What's up guys? We get zero views here and yes, we are finally back with some more Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. And in the previous episode, we arrived in these uh this weird this weird little 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 swamp here, swampy area. And I have no idea what to expect. Like I, I think I know if it's anything based on the original, but uh, it might be played all differently here, yes. And there's a crate here. Alright. But yeah, let's go ahead and um, Explore? Because I don't really know what else I can potentially look I, I did see a sign for the Chocobo Ranch, and I feel like we have to go there. I mean, where else, where else are we going to go? Like, like seriously. I mean, let's, let, let's kind of peruse around. We can peruse. We can peruse in Peru. It's a crate here. A Moogle Metal. That was kind of useful back in the day as well. Back in the day meaning... <laughs> The previous game now obviously a lot of people already finished the game like uh, I, already, I already know that for a fact um, because I'm currently what in part 9 maybe 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 around 9 and um, people already finished this and this is like I'm like in on the, the, the recording date for this if you're curious is is April 19th uh, I'm not sure when the video actually goes live but it's probably months later <laughs> Probably, but um, you know, just for uh, you know, future clarity there, future clarity or future, I don't know, future Talos will 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 make a comment about that maybe. But um, yes, we're and I, I like for me, I'm just kind of enjoying enjoying the, the landscape, enjoying the gameplay, enjoying the life. Um, I was spoiled a little bit, but not really. Like I don't know what the ending is. Obviously, I don't know. I I saw some like potential romance thing but we kind of already knew that in previous games okay i didn't even know you were here yeah we knew that in previous games so i'm not really like like too surprised about that but for those that played my previous playthroughs you, you know who i'm gonna romance you already know that so and the person i'm gonna romance is the one i'm controlling right now so that's that's an obvious all right let's see do i have any synergic ener no i don't I have Blizzard, apparently. Punisher, baby! And another thing that uh, I will say as well, like, um, the last time I played this game was like, a couple of weeks ago. A couple of weeks ago. But I do like to record like a couple episodes per day. So, um, and just kind of upload it as need be. But as soon as I get done with some other playthroughs, I can probably finish this a little bit more quicker. Ooh, summon! Oh no, it's it's uh it's starting to build. Never mind. Where is he? Okay. Bench blow. Do I have that? I don't think cool. Fire. No. Guess not. You ready? I can almost summon. I, I kind of want to see what the summon looks like, even though it's kind of a waste on this one enemy. How do I? How do I summon? Here we go. Chocobo and Moogle. Do your thing. Do your thing. I can't even see you. All right, summoning blah 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 blah. Okay. I assume they can it can they attack on their own? Are you gonna stay with me? Oh, you disappeared. It'd be cool if I can ride a chocobo. But I guess not. But yeah, I'm fully aware that everyone already finished the game, so... But I'm not even, like, stressing about it, because, um... I still get decent views on this, even though the channel's called We Get Zero Views. Um, but I do get some decent views. I'm gonna skip him if I can. Looks like I can. Probably going the wrong way, I bet you. Let me check the map. Okay, we need to go there, so we need to follow the map. So we could probably make a left turn over in Albuquerque. And go from there. This is the city, right? Oh no, there's Bill's Chocobo Ranch. Okay, obviously. Obviously. 
Yeah, don't forget that left turn in Albuquerque. And there, like, uh, there, there's one that, that was really spoiled to me, was the fact that uh, um, apparently <laughs> Aerith and uh, Tifa had some pretty sexy outfits. Pretty sexy outfits. Um, I'll probably have a screenshot of it right now, but uh, yeah, I can't wait for that part. Bring it! Ooh, there's a uh, little bench here. Cool. <laughs> when it's broken, fantastic. Uh, yeah, why not? No advertisement of Loveless. Love it. Even though it's Loveless. <laughs> okay, cool. Beans. All right. What about map say? Okay, follow, follow the path. Can I go inside? You know what, uh, every time I see a windmill, like real life and video games, it reminds me of the windmill in like uh, that one Zelda game with that same theme song. It might, be, might, get, might get copyrighted, but I'll play it right here for a small sample. All right, enough of that, enough of that. It's the copyrighted stuff. Oh, I'm going wrong. <laughs> Past it. <laughs> God damn it. The windmill distracted me, I guess. It was this close. Want these? Thank you. Let me explore the surroundings real quick. I don't think there's anything fantastic. I would imagine we will get chocobos already from these posts. Is that you, Bill? Pleasure to see you all again. And welcome to my humble ranch. Managed to get your truck fixed? Indeed I did. You must have been my lucky charms. She started up right after you left. Anywho, what can I do you for? You in the market for some fine feathered friends? By Maybe. Can, can we raise them? Are we ever. Need them to get through the swamp lands. Then you have come to the right place. Back in the day, we had Republic fairies to get us from A to B. But now they're nothing but driftwood, sadly. We got the next best thing, though. Chocobos. To them, a bottomless bog's no worse than a kiddie pool. Now, ladies, you're probably wondering what gives these birds the power to glide across swamps. Why you're asking the ladies? That's 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 sexist. They know. Uh... Okay, maybe not. Would you believe that their fluffy feathers give them the buoyancy to float while their little <laughs> the legs buoyancy. get out on a motorboat? Not FF logic right there. Guard Sormer, one of the fastest fiends around, can keep up with them. Oh, wow. <laughs> but you don't need convincing. You just need pointing to a hard-working chocobo. Nature's two-legged limousine. Now, you, you're, you're going too far there with the cell. Sure can. My grandson Billy's in the stable over yonder. Bill and Billy. Help you out. Of course it's going to be a Billy. What about your daughter? Billion. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, so let us proceed to Billy. Billy Bob. Billy Joel. Billy Armstrong. Where's Billy? Are you Billy? Making a racket? Oh, here. Howdy. Hey, it's Billy. Saw the sign. Eat some chocobos to cross the swamp. I'm sorry, Pops, but you're out of luck. Oh no. Pops. I'm not that old. More birds. Last one went this morning. Could have fooled me, kid. <laughs> These are spoken for. That or they're not fit for riding. But I can see you're in a bind, so I'll bump you up the list for a price. Oh, damn. Which is 10 grand each. What? We're we poor. That kind of money. Yeah, we're poor. Or any, really. Yeah, we just bought items. <laughs> well, there is one other option. Only cost you a grand. Uh, oh, we don't have that either. Is what a scoundrel might say. But I wouldn't dream of distressing y'all further. Just so happens one of our birds ran off the other day. Wild thing, but still a fine chocobo. If you can manage to find and catch him, then he's yours, free of charge. You sure One chocobo for five yeah, people? Why not? Name's Pico, Pico. the hardest-headed bird you'll ever meet, by far. This feels like a side mission. The spitting image of Pops here. <laughs> you can start by looking for his tracks. Find those, and you're sure to find the feet that made him. 
Now, wild chocobos can be a bit skittish around people. But if you play it cool and creep up real quiet-like, you'll wrangle them no problem. I think we can do that. Thanks. And one last thing. This info comes free of charge, provided you promise to stop by our shop. Speak to Chloe back there. She'll sell you whatever you need. <laughs> Kids are born businessmen. <laughs> Y'all can catch our runaway and get his butt back here. Riding and rearing lessons are on me. What a sales pitch. What a sales pitch. Alright, can I steal some items first? Yeah, I wanna steal I wanna steal all your items. Yeah, you don't have to, you don't have to stop me. It's fine. I know what I'm doing. It's about a like rustling noise. It's like Is there another ladder somewhere? I know. A <laughs> warning. God damn. Forced conversation here. Is money. He's just doing his job. We understand. I know the deal. I suppose, but he's been a real pain about it ever since our parents left. Oh, B B Bill, B Bill's not your father? So, are you guys from Midgar? Yeah, the Undercity. Then do you happen to know Chocobo Sam? Um, he sounds familiar. Well, but yeah, I guess we do. Where is he? Probably the Sector 6 slums. He's a big deal in Vault. Um, why do you ask? I was thinking about reaching out. It's his fault mom and dad are gone. What? So what do you do? Chloe, that's none of these good folks' business. But they get help. Don't tell anyone what she told you. Sam's one of the biggest names in the business. If he gets wind of that story, our ranch is done for. Don't worry, your secret's safe with and us. And there goes the money. I promise. Take these greens. You can give them to Pico when you find him. They were always his favorite. Pico de Mayo. Maybe he'll come back once he's had a taste. Right. Should probably sell you stuff, huh? Billy will throw a fit if I don't at least try to get you to spend a few gil. No pressure, but if anything catches your eye. Also, if you have any golden plumes on you, I can exchange them for chocobo gear. So be sure to do hand them over if you do. I don't think I do. Trade? Nine of golden plumes. So much collectibles! But at least it's not microtransactions though. It's, it's all in-game currency. Alright, look at my materials here. And that's good to know. Good to know. I have five gil only. Not good to know. I hope Pico doesn't give you all too much trouble. Discovery Golden Plumes, okay. Alright. Let's get me some pro chocobos. Right, Pico. Pico de Mayo, this you is mean Pico? Let's try looking for some tracks. That's his full name, Pico de Mayo. Can I climb this? No, I cannot. I am not that agile apparently. I can jump high in cutscenes, but I can't jump high in real life. Over here. I can, I, can, I can climb that, right? Come on, man. All right, let's check the map real quick. Damn, he's far. Really? Oh, no. It says location unknown. Oh, about to say. About to say. I, I bet you it's right here. I bet you some kind of money. But then again, follow the tracks. Follow the tracks. I don't see any tracks. Is that tracks? No. I don't even know what the tracks will look like. I mean, the only thing I think of is I uh, just keep following the path. I don't feel like it's over in this direction. I kind of feel like it's around here somewhere. I just don't know where. 
So I'm just gonna kind of uncover some of this like gray area and go from there. The quest continues. Where Where is Pico? Oh boy, here we go. I guess we can like cross a little bit over here and see if there's anything that's obvious. I, I still don't know what the trail, the track looks like. Oh wait, wait, wait. I see, I see Chocobo's down there. But which one's Pico? Yeah, come on y'all, let's go back us a Chocobo. That's gotta be Pico, yep, okay. Thanks for the Keep clue. When you're on the hunt, you don't want to startle your prey. Prey? You know we're not here to kill him, right? <laughs> yeah. Sure. Approach Pico without being noticed. If you're in danger of being spotted by him or one of his pack mates, quickly press O to roll out of sight. You can also distract tools by throwing stones you pick up. Use L1 to aim and D to th or square to cl close. How do I... Where's the stones? Can I capture, like, his companions? I would imagine I probably have to. How do I... Wait a minute. Ah, this is annoying. Roll out of the way. Come on. Am I hidden? Okay. Where's the rock? Oh, here. To distract. How do I... Turn around, Pico. Turn around. Pico's not turning around. It's a big ass rock. Come on, Pico. Come on, Pico. Got him! Got him! Cause it wasn't too bad. That was it could have been a lot more annoying, but it wasn't too bad. Now you love me. <laughs> Aw, isn't he just the cutest? <laughs> He's gonna take over the world. Is that the Chocobo theme song? We about to bust some rhymes right around right now. You know, they are kind of similar. Totally. <laughs> and this 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 song goes hard. What does he want now? Gangsta. Do you think maybe he's still hungry? Boop. Sorry, that's all the food we had. But you know where there's more? Place. Oh yeah. <gasps> Back to the ranch it is then. Come on. Wow. What kind of song is this? Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, let Let's conclude the mission with Bill. But this song is freaking good. I, I like I, I think this 
I'm pretty sure this, this also appeared in the previous game as well, but I just don't remember it as much. But this song is hella gangster. Hella. Like hella. We about to bust some rhymes right about now. Okay, I know for that. Oh, Chuck was so cute. Hmm. Huh. <laughs> Not so much as a feather out of place. Got one healthy bird here. Enough to ride. Now it's my bird. Sure. Though I wouldn't try till he's done eating. Once he's out of fill, though, I'm sure he'll come around to the idea if we ask him this. Ain't that right? I'll need to prep his gear and all that. So why don't you wait outside? All right. Wait, what's happening? Oh my God, it's you! Hey there. You're back. What a pleasant surprise. Chadley. With his you high knee me, shorts. Don't you? Yeah, of course I remember you. Yeah. I knew you would. It was an absolute pleasure. Yeah, she does like hope from FF13 as well, but it's besides the point. Your valuable intel allowed me to create so much materia. My god, what's the close up? Detecting internal monologue. The hell's this weirdo doing here? <laughs> I was created by Professor Hojo, you know. You were! Now your thoughts could be read by any cyborg. You're a cyborg? But to answer your question, what's with the twist now? I took a page out of your book and skipped town. Now, the whole world's my laboratory. Speaking of which, I have a favor to ask, if it's not too much trouble. You need more battle intel. That's Bingo! Always eager to get on with it. But yes, though, I'd like you to activate some Remna Wave Towers first. They were originally constructed by the Republic of Juno, but were claimed by Shinra after the war. Since which time they've sat idle and untouched, just waiting for someone to put them to good use. The more towers you activate around the world, the more my processing power will grow. As will the area I can survey. I might even be able to construct a communications network independent of Shinra. Mm. How does that sound? You'd not only be helping me, but yourselves as well. There's sort of all these like salespeople coming to me that were like, we find him. We'll turn him on. For help. Wonderful. I thought you might say Wonderful. Like that. Let's get started then. See that tower? That's your first target. I don't want to go there. And this will activate it. But I don't want to go there. <laughs> His name is Chad Module. The towers close by. Allow me to accompany you. No, I don't want to go there. I actually want to conclude. Yes, I do. But yes, guys, that concludes today's episode. And yes, it was the most gangster of raps with it, the Chocobo rap music. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this. Obviously, we finally found this this chocobo the, the mini game I'm, I'm not sure if that's gonna be the same mini game all the time um to, like capturing chocobos because i know there was a big thing in the, the original ff7 where you can capture them train them race them um i would imagine there's some type of chocobo, chocobo racing here as well i really hope so because i love chocobo racing uh, especially if it's done cool you know not, 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 not weird but cool but anyway enough rambling guys that pretty much includes it my name is Talos, this is Fantasy 7 Rebirth, and I will see you next time. Peace.